this day, October the 16th, we remember Bishops Hugh Latimer and Nicholas Ridley and Thomas Cranmer, Archbishop of Canterbury, martyrs for the church. Light and peace in Jesus Christ, our Lord. Thanks be to God. I will bless the Lord who gives me counsel. My heart teaches me night after night. I have set the Lord always before me. Because he is at my right hand, I shall not fall. O oh God, make speed to save us. O oh Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Hallelujah. Remaining standing, let us sing together the hymn for light, for gracious light.
A reading from the Gospel of John. Remember the word that I said to you. Oh, wait. A reading from the first letter of Paul to the Corinthians. For we are God's servants, working together. You are God's field, God's building. According to the grace of God given to me, like a skilled master builder, I have laid a foundation, and someone else is building on it. Each builder must choose with care how to build on it. For no one can lay any foundation other than the one that has been laid. The foundation is Jesus Christ. Now if anyone builds on the foundation with gold, silver, precious stones, wood, hay, straw, the work of each builder will become visible. For the day will disclose it, because it will be revealed with fire. And the fire will test what sort of work each has done. If what has been built on the foundation survives, the builder will receive a reward. The word of the Lord. Thanks be God. I will stand and sing a paraphrase of the Son of Mary as found in your bulletin. From the Gospel of John. Remember the word that I said to you. Servants are not greater than their master. If they, pros if they persecuted me, they will persecute you. If they kept my word, they will keep yours also. But they will do all these things to you on account of my name, because they do not know him who sent me. If I had not come and spoken to them, they would not have sinned. But now they have ex no excuse for their sin. Whoever hates me hates my father also. If I had not done among them the works that no one else did, they would not have sinned. But now they have seen and both hated me and my father. It was to fulfill the word that is written in their law. They hated me without a cause. When the advocate comes, whom I will send to you from the father, the spirit of truth, who comes from the Father. He will testify on my behalf. You are also to testify because you have been with me from the beginning. 
I have said these things to you to keep you from stumbling. The word of the Lord. Let us stand and sing a paraphrase of the Song of Obsidian. Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life of the last thing. Be our companion in the way, 
kindle our hearts and awaken hope that we may know you as you are revealed in scripture and the breaking of bread. Grant this for the sake of your love. Amen. Amen. Let us all say the prayer of mission together. Keep watch, dear Lord, with those who work or watch or leave this night, and give your angels charge of those who sleep. Tend the sick, Lord Christ. Give rest to the weary. Bless the dying. Soothe the suffering. Get the afflicted, shield the joyous, and all for your love's sake.
remaining standing, let us, let us all stand. At this point in our service, your intercessions, prayers, thanksgivings are here invited, either out loud or in the silence of your hearts. Thank you, Lord, for those men and women who to this day, in 2019, are still prepared to die for their beliefs. of the name we pray. Continuing together, Almighty God, Father of all mercies, we, your unworthy servants, give you humble thanks for all your goodness and loving kindness to us and to all whom you have made. We bless you for our creation, preservation, and all the blessings of this life, but above all for your immeasurable love in the redemption of the world by our Lord Jesus Christ, for the means of grace and to the hope of glory. And we pray, give us such an awareness of your mercies, that with truly thankful hearts, we may show forth your praise, not only with our lips, but in our lives, by giving of ourselves to your service, and by walking before you in holiness and righteousness all our days, through Jesus Christ our Lord, to whom with you and the Holy Spirit be honor and glory throughout all ages. Amen. Let us sing together the office <laughs>
Yours are the eyes through which he looks compassion on this world. Yours are the feet with which he walks to do good. Yours are the hands through which he blesses all the world. Yours are the hands. Yours are the feet. Yours are the eyes. Yours are the fire. Thank you. 